I made a quick little breakfast with two eggs and some spinach, a little bit of avocado, and two slices of low sodium bacon. And this will be my breakfast to start the day. I got some stuff for under the bathroom. I wanted some storage um, containers. These are snackable. So I got two different sizes and I got two of them. So I felt like that would be perfect for like beauty products, hair products, whatever. And then for like toiletry stuff. So I got gray to match the gray of uh, this liner, which literally that's perfect. Babe, look at that. Look. How perfect the gray matches Ooh. for the bathroom. Nice. Um, I also got stuff for like kitchen. Um, these are a two pack and I really like these for like kitchen utensils. This is perfect for all my straws and things. So I got that one and then Joey needed some razor blades. So Ooh. it's literally getting a little crowded in here. <laughs> but I'm gonna go ahead and get started on dinner. I'm making a chicken and chili soup. I'm gonna do it in the Dutch oven and do it really quick. And then we're gonna top it with some toppings. I'll show you guys that. And that will be dinner. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I'll leave the recipe um, linked down below in the description box if you guys wanna make it. And it's gonna be perfect because all day it's been raining like cats and dogs. So it'll be a nice soup to go for tonight. This bone broth is really cool. It's by Dr. Kelly Ann. It's just the home style. They have like a ton of flavors. You just add it into boiling water. And this is the broth I'm gonna use for the soup. I just measured out some water. Gonna add the broth into there. It's just like a powdered form. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. Cool concept. I'm adding cilantro to the top. If you don't like cilantro, you could do fresh parsley, but a fresh herb is like really good on top of this soup. Luckily, everyone who's eating this likes cilantro, so I have a little bit in this cup. And then I'm gonna pull the chicken out and shred it and then put it back in and add the remainder of the canned things and frozen corn and some beans and cream cheese. For Brookie, come here, boy. Oh, you are here. Okay. So I'm going to the Trans Siberian concert, and I really don't know what to wear, but I picked this up at Target. It's just like a red shirt, and it's gonna be cold. So I'm thinking. I have this little cute beige blazer. It's actually super cute. 
I haven't tried it on though. It's from Cider. It looks a little big. I wish I could have gotten it in a smaller size. But I do like the oversized look with the red top and either a black skirt or um, pants. And then some boots. And then I like my hair like this. Half down, half up clip. So I got this super cute clip from Target also. It's gold with these like little jewels. I thought that would look really cute in my hair. Let's see. What do you guys think? I feel like that would look cute, right? Um, really good quality too. With the red shirt, add a little Christmas to it. I'm going to try on this blazer. I feel like I'll wear a skirt with it so like it's short and then like the blazer is like the length okay this is so cute I really like this blazer this is again from cider I love the length of it so I'll wear like a short black skirt and that red top I think that'll be cute okay so I have some things to organize these are the bins they're stackable too, which is awesome. Ugh, so I have to get these stickers off. Does anyone else just, why even put stickers on? We need to just do tags, like paper tags, not, not stickers. <laughs> um, I have like hair products and stuff I need to, but I don't use like all the time. So I'm just adding all of that into these bins. I guess I can't stack the little one though on top because these I'm doing these so tall. So I don't know, we'll have to play with it. I mean, I'm gonna use everything up for sure. I just want to start, you know. I have so much like extras. I don't even think this is good anymore. Okay, that's what I have so far. I still have a ton of stuff in the house, but I'm obviously using it um, daily, so I don't wanna bring it in yet. So it's good that I have some room. I'm gonna need more though, cause I have quite a bit of stuff in the house. Um, so yeah, but this is it so far, and I love the containers. I got them from Target, and I really like them. So those are good. I smell it. Jojo finished the pool. Is he still working on the pool? A disaster. But we're got we got storage stuff in. Um, look at this. We got a ton of stuff in today. So it's raining. The weather is shit. But we're gonna get some stuff done because like everything is everywhere because we need furniture and storage cabinets and things so we are gonna put all of that together but we're officially living we're officially sleeping and living full-time in the RV but our couch is delayed of course so we have the mattress on the floor and there's still things we have so much things to do and finish but we're just happy to be in the RV and we're gonna get some things done today We've had a lot that's happened. We had our neighbor's tree. His tree fell in his yard, which is like right practically in our yard, it feels like. So that was kind of hectic. We had to get out of the RV when they moved the tree just in case anything fell on the RV. So that's a little bit of a stressor. We might have to have some other trees moved and taken down, but we're trying to just not think about that right now and just get get ready um, to get some stuff stored away so I have this little storage cabinet that I'm putting here I bought some really cute cute knobs for it 
because the knobs were very boring and I just, I don't know, anything, I want everything to just look really, really cute and the knobs were boring but I got some cute knobs so I'll show you guys that but I am going to put it together so we can start putting stuff in it and then we have a big storage cabinet, um, like we're going to use this doorway right here because we don't use it anyways because of the wardrobe but we have this gray wardrobe. It's really skinny and it's gonna fit right in the door, which is perfect. And that's where we're gonna store our linens and pillowcases because it's just all right here. And then we got some cabinets, or no, these aren't cabinets, these are shelves. Shelves for skincare. So we're gonna put that here and here's me, I'm surviving. <laughs> and then Joey's gonna actually have to build some cabinets in here so everything is just literally thrown in here um for now until he can do that which he's doing a lot so I'm not too concerned about this right now um we have the wrong hooks for our shower rod so we're taking those down and we ordered the correct size so we can finally get our shower rod in here to take showers um I don't know if I showed on YouTube we got our wardrobes these are wardrobes and everything pretty much fits that I'm currently wearing. I just have to go through like seasons. So like summer, when summer's here, I'll take all the sweaters out, obviously, and then put summer clothes in. Um, take all my sweatpants out, put my shorts back in, and dresses and things. But for now, it fits everything I need and more. I have these West Elm baskets, which are the perfect size. They're so good. Like, look how big and perfect. But, oh, let me try to get this up <laughs> with one hand. Um, I ordered a second one. So I'll have a second one here, which will be plenty. And then this is the drawers. I don't know how neat they are because it's just been crazy. But all my shirts, like sleep shirts and like casual shirts, fit here rolled up. And then leggings and sweat shorts um, and things like that are rolled up in here fits great we are going to build our bed frame and then wow look at this floor <laughs> that's where we're going to store all of our shoes and purses and like extra things and laundry baskets under this so I know it's hard to envision but you'll see it's gonna it's gonna work this is Joey's wardrobe he has plenty of space he's so happy to finally have his shirts not all folded if you guys have been around you guys know his wardrobe before was just like I felt so bad, but everything was pretty much folded for him. He didn't have any hanging space, but now he does. He has a full wardrobe, and it's it's great. So happy about that. Um, yeah, so we're going to get to building stuff and getting things done, and then I'll show you guys again, but we're officially in it. It feels so good. We have so much of the floor done. Joey just has a little section he's going to finish tonight. And we got our tile in for the kitchen. I went with a totally different tile. Um, so that soon will look totally different. <laughs> um, and then we're gonna build our desk. We just have a lot of stuff to do. This was a really big project and you know, we're just slowly trying to get things done with the holidays and going around and seeing family. Oh, my curtains are up too, you guys. I got curtains, so. They need to be hemmed. Um, Joey's grandma's gonna do that. But they're so, so nice. They're so soft. They are that like wrinkly textured material, which I personally really like, and so did Joey. We were back and forth on it, and we're so happy that we went with it. Um, but they're beautiful. They just need to be hemmed. Um, they make, I don't know, they just make the house feel very cozy. And I like the texture. So, yeah, we just gotta get them hemmed. There's our bed on the floor. <laughs> All right, here we have the little cabinet. Again, I'm gonna get new little knobs. I already got them, they are ordered. And then I can put storage in here, like cans and any kind of kitchen stuff I need. I have my espresso cups and little plates right there. My espresso maker. And I don't know what else I'm going to do to it, but that's it for now. And then now, Joey hung the skincare shelves. So I'm going to go ahead and put all my skincare up. I'm so excited about that. <laughs> Cute. 
cute. I have my face mask up top. I'll be probably adding more things to this, but this is what it looks like for now. My moisturizer and serums, face wash, things I use more often on the bottom. And yeah, I'm just getting rid of these um, few things. Okay, we built our chairs. These are gonna be our desk chairs. We wanted something really comfy with a really plush bottom and a high top. So we went with like an actual accent chair. It's so, so comfortable. It's black and white stripe, which is super cute because for, hey, for our desk, we're going with this blue color. We're gonna paint our desk this one right here. We actually were inspired by these colors because um, I just love those colors. So I was like, a blue desk would look so stunning with these chairs and the floor. And I just add a pop of color. So we're going to do our desk there. And then I built this, which I mentioned we had new furniture. So look how perfect it fits in the door. Like it's literally looks like it's supposed to be here we have to clean up some tape we have so much cleaning up with the tape and like paint we have so many touch-ups we need to do um but look how good this looks it looks so good i don't know if i'm gonna leave this here yet it's just going there for now while we keep unpacking but all our towels are in here and sheets and things are down here so it has lots of extra storage and I think it looks really good. I am making a little lunch. I'm craving a pizza, so I'm using this flatbread I got from Target. It's 90 calories per flatbread. I added a little bit of pizza sauce, a little bit of reduced fat mozzarella, and turkey pepperoni. And then I'm just gonna bake it for about 12 minutes on 450 in the oven. And this is a little pizza. You could add anything else onto it, but <laughs> we don't really have too much we need to go grocery stopping so um i would add some italian seasoning but i i need to get some seasonings we don't know where our seasonings are so i just did salt pepper to the top let's do okay here is the pizza done i'll show you guys her on the plate after i cut her up she cuts really well the flatbread's so thin just don't over you know top it and it won't it'll be it'll stay nice and crispy so oh my gosh this looks so good there she is you guys have to try this it's a really great low calorie healthy option for if you're having craving for pizza it's so yummy you'll love it this chair is so comfy I love it. I'm so glad that I picked this one out. I am about to get to work and edit some videos and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'm going to be pushing out some content this month now that we're back in the RV. I just feel so good to be back in the RV and ready to film. So thank you guys for your patience during that whole transition. Um, I will see you guys in my next one. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.